Hello everybody, welcome back to my Minecraft world. Today we're taking a look at the Naturalist add-on that adds in some new features and 20 new animals. And we're going to take a look at all the new animals today. The first animal we are going to go ahead and look at today is the angler fish. Here is the spawn egg, here is the raw fish, here is the cooked fish, and the bucketed variants. So let's go ahead and see what they look like in the water now and see what we get. Oh, they're cool. They're real cool. Oh, look at that. There's a brown one and a little blue glowy one. The next animal is the badger, which can be found in the entrances of forest biomes. And upon death, they will drop fur and bush meat. I'm not going to read everything in the book because I kind of want to just do a quick little, little speed run. But here are the new badgers. They're so cute. I love them. Oh, there's a little baby. Oh, I love the baby. That is so cute. Hello, little friend. Hello. The next item is the blobfish, and you can also um, eat them <laughs> as well and put them in a bucket. Uh, there's the raw one, the cooked version, and the bucketed version. Let's go ahead and see what the blobfish looks like in the water. And oh my gosh, that looks amazing. My new best friend. <laughs> The next animal is the cave fish, also an aqua animal. You can also eat them and cook them. So there's lots of new food variants. You can also put them in a bucket. Let's go ahead and see what the cave fish looks like in the water. Oh, it's cute and little. I love it. Adorable. The next animal is the eel. And it kind of reminds me of Little Mermaid. <laughs> you can also put them in buckets and you can also cook them and eat them. Here's the bucket right there and the cooked and raw versions. They are kind of long. Let's go ahead and see what they look like in the water. And yeah, there we go. Under the sea. Very cool. Let's see. There are different colors of them. But they all look like this. Maybe it's for specific biomes? I don't know, but that's a lot of eels right there. The eels are taking over. <laughs> we have the flying fish. You can also put it in the bucket. You cannot eat the flying fish, but they will drop feathers upon death. And here's the little bucketed version. Let's go ahead and see what they look like in the water. Oh, they're adorable. They're like little sea butterflies. So cute. Giant isopod is the next one. It comes in brown and gray. You can also put it in a bucket. There is no cookable versions of that. Let's go ahead and see what they look like in the water. Oh my gosh, little bugs. Little sea bugs. Oh, that was a baby. <gasps> They're evolving. Giant salamander is the next one. It has a couple different color variants and you can go ahead and eat their tails if you want to. Who would want to do that? That's crazy. But let's go ahead and see what the salamander looks like. Oh, they're cool. Oh, man. I like these buddies. Oh, they're going in the water. Swim, little friends. Swim. Go. Frolic. Look like there's too many lily pads and there's too many fish in there. Oh, you went in there. That's so cute. I love his little face. That is amazing. My new best fishy little friends. Next, we have the new gorillas. And upon death, they will drop fur and melons. And their little babies will also... Oh my gosh, salamanders, hi! Uh, the babies will also... Yes, there's one little baby on top of Mama's back. That is so cute. Hello, little guys. That is so awesome. Look at the little baby. We have the iguanas. You can also eat their tails. <laughs> And here's what they look like. There are different color variations. There we go. Oh, nice. Beautiful. There you go, little buddies. Kangaroos are the next animal, and they will drop bush meat upon death and hide. Don't eat the kangaroos. I mean, I guess a lot of people eat kangaroos in the world. You can do what you want. It's none of my business. Uh, but they will also have little babies in their pouch sometime. Uh, let's see if we can get a little baby. There we go. Little baby in the pouch. And apparently the players can go in the pouch for a small amount of time as well. Maybe we have to be in survival. Oh gosh. Oh, the gorillas are mad. Can I go in your pouch? Let me in your pouch. Uh, technical difficulties. Can I go in your pouch? Save me. Save me. Oh no, they don't, they don't like me. They don't like me at all. 
Eros has been slain by kangaroo. Next, we have the little moles. You can breed them with beetles, and they will drop fur and dirt when they die. And there's the cute little moles. Look at you guys. So cute. Oh, look at him walking. I believe in you. Next, we have the platypus, and it comes in a couple different variants. So let's go ahead and see what they look like. Oh, there's little cuties. And it does show that they can be picked up in the bucket, which is awesome. You can go ahead and take your little friends with you. Let's make sure it's those ones, because I do have platypuses in the pet add-on. Let's see if a water bucket works. Oh yes, you can pick up your little platypus in the water bucket. Next, we have adorable little rats, which you can actually tame and have little pets. And upon death, they will drop morsels and fur. And there's a couple different variants. Look at these little rats. Oh my gosh, so cute. They come in white and also black. I love them. I'm definitely going to get tons of little rat pets. I actually had rats in real life. Rats are nice pets. They're really smart and cute and cuddly and nice. And I love them. Hi, little buddies. Next is red panda, and they will drop bush meat and fur upon death. You can also tame them with bamboo, so you can get another pet. A little red panda buddy. They're adorable. Hello. Hello, friend. We need to get lots of friends. Oh, so cute. I love animals. And next we have seals, and the seals will drop fish and hide when killed. And uh, they're semi-aquatic, so they can kind of live in the water and outside of the water. But they're really cute. Look at you go, little buddy. You want me to help you? There you go. You can go in the water. Next we have the slug, and apparently you can jump on the slug's back and it'll make you bounce. Upon death, the slugs will drop slime balls, and it looks like you can also put the slugs in buckets and carry them around. But here are our cute little slug friends. Hello. Oh, we bouncing? They're like a bouncy house. Oh, the kangaroos are bouncing too. They make a little funny noise. <laughs> I hope this doesn't hurt. I don't want to kill my new friends. Next, we have starfish, and looks like you can also carry them in buckets as well. Let's go ahead and put some in the water. So cute. Oh, that is a slug. Oh, oh the seals are killing the slugs. The seals are killing everything. The seals killed the blobfish. Uh, the seals are hunger. It's the circle of lice. Nothing to see here. Um, starfish, yeah. And you can also put them in buckets. I don't know if I said that, but uh... Or some octopuses. Oh my gosh. Are you gonna kill the starfish too, seals? They're so hungry. Look at all this deadness. There's feathers and blobs. Next are the turkeys. You can go ahead and breed them with seeds. And the turkeys will drop drumsticks and you can cook and eat them. Here are the cute little turkeys. Adorable. And delicious. Next we have walruses. Let's go ahead and see what they look like. Oh, they big. <gasps> And adorable. I love them. They are amazing. They probably can swim in the water as well. There you go, little guy. <laughs> There's so many animals in here. It's getting crazy. And that was the last animal. Uh, after that, we have the recipe for the capture nets and the hamster cages and the wheel. The new, that's not new, but the shell blocks. And here are the socials for the Starfish Studios that makes the Naturalist mod, and it'll restart. So like I said, those are the new animals, but there are like a hundred other animals, which I guess I'll go ahead and scroll through the book. So in case you're not aware of all the other animals that are in this add-on. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you guys are having a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye!
That was all of them. Thank you for staying to the end. Hi. How are you?